Alex with windowcleaner.com. It's glove season, fall, winter, early spring glove season, depending on where you are in the country. This is the lineup of gloves that we currently carry at windowcleaner.com. I just want to touch on each one of these, show you a highlight, a low light, what have you about each one of these gloves we offer to help your decision making just a little bit. So uh, this is a simple poly dipped glove. Okay for window cleaning, um, if you're in an area that's really not super cold, this will just keep your hands a little dry, definitely cleaner, and you'll still have plenty of feel for maneuvering a towel, for detailing, and you'll have a good handle on your equipment. So just a poly dip glove, good for window cleaning, great for gutter cleaning. Next we have this glove from Youngstown. This is definitely a glove that's going to keep you warm. It's not gonna keep you extremely dry, but it's a glove that'll keep you warm, has excellent grip, it's pretty thick, insulated nicely, has a Velcro strap on here, um, a tad on the bulky side, but if you're working in a very cold environment where you try not to get too wet, this is a glove that will work for you. Next we have, in the Glacier Glove lineup, we have the Guide Glove. The Guide Glove is a little bit thinner, so you retain some dexterity, which is really nice, good for detailing. The palm on this is leather, so you have a decent grip on your tools as well. Uh, keep you a little bit dry and a little bit warm, not for those deep sub-zero temperatures. These are simply glove liners. They come in two different sizes. You get a medium large and an extra large double XL. Um, these are just gonna go underneath some of these other gloves to help just keep you a little bit warmer, add a little bit of padding in there. Inexpensive, nice, easy, get a few pairs, no problem. The Unger Neoprene Glove. So neoprene gloves, they are like a wetsuit. It's gonna keep you dry to a point, but it's also gonna let some moisture in and you're gonna create a moisture barrier between your hand and the glove to kind of insulate you a little bit. So nice gloves, these have been around for a long time. Uh, extra grippy on the front, uh, really nice for just holding your tools. You have decent dexterity with these. Neoprene, it's kind of a go-to. The rest of these are neoprene gloves as well, different gloves from Glacier, and I'll give you a little bit of uh, insight into each of these. So these are the Ice Bay. So the Ice Bay are fleece-lined, neoprene, uh, same grip all around. The palm is the same as the fingers and the uh, whole body of the glove. These are pretty warm. They're gonna keep you pretty dry as well, but they are neoprene, so you're gonna get a little bit of moisture in there, but the fleece lining on the inside is what's really gonna keep you extra warm. Next are the Kanai. Neoprene, waterproofish, really just a basic glacier glove. Not gonna keep you super duper warm, but comfy nonetheless. It's kind of uh, pretty close to the Unger glove as far as capabilities. And then lastly, also from Glacier, we have the Perfect Curve. Same story, we're in neoprene again. These are also fleece lined, but the idea behind the Perfect Curve is if you can see my robotic almost hand here, uh, it's in the curve position here. Maybe a little bit nicer for holding onto tools. You may get less bunching in the glove as you're holding onto an extension pole, or your squeegee handle. Uh, gonna keep you fairly warm, fairly dry. Just another interesting glove from Glacier. I hope this makes your glove buying decision making a little bit easier. Be sure to check out our full range of gloves at windowcleaner.com.